and welcome everyone to our Creepypasta Chronicles, where your nightmares come alive. If you're ready to dive into the realm of the eerie and unexplainable, you've come to the right place. Don't forget to turn off the lights, put on your headphones, and let your imagination paint the most chilling images. And remember, if you enjoy our narrations, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the like button at the end of the video. Let's uncover the mysterious and terrifying world that exists in the shadows. Now, on to our story, Unseen Bedfellow, a true chilling tale. In the quiet suburban town of Wintersfield, nestled amidst sprawling woods, lived a young woman named Emma. She was known for her solitary lifestyle, living alone in an old creaky house that she inherited from her late grandmother. Emma's only companions were the whispering winds and her own echoing footsteps. One tranquil night, Emma retired to her room. The house lulled into a serene silence. She slid under the covers, comforted by the soft hum of the house settling. Just as sleep began to claim her, she felt a weight shift at the foot of her bed. Dismissing it as her imagination, she closed her eyes. A few moments later, she felt it again, this time nearer. A cold dread slid down her spine. She froze, eyes wide open, heart pounding in the quiet of the room. She turned on the bedside lamp. The room was still, the bed empty except for her. She sighed, chiding herself for her childlike fears. Turning off the light, she tried to sleep again, but the sensation returned. Something was moving under the covers, closing in on her. Days turned into weeks, each night a torment. The presence grew bolder and whispers echoed around her room like a chilling lullaby. She could feel the presence breathing beside her, even feel the non-existent bedmate shifting positions. Emma was trapped in a living nightmare. She sought help from the local priest and paranormal investigators, but they found nothing. Her friends, concerned for her mental health, urged her to see a therapist, but Emma knew what she was experiencing was real. One night, Emma mustered the courage to confront her unseen bedfellow. As she felt the movement in the bed, she turned to face it. Speaking into the dark, she asked, Who are you? What do you want? A whispering gush of wind responded, sending chills down her spine. Not alone. Never alone. From that day on, Emma was never alone. The unseen presence made sure of that. Emma was seen talking to the air, laughing and sometimes even crying. Rumors spread around town. People whispered about the crazy Lady of Wintersfield. Yet Emma accepted her fate, her unseen bedfellow, an eerie reality that she learned to live with. Until one night, she vanished. The townsfolk found her house eerily quiet, her bed made with precision. But Emma was nowhere to be seen, no trace of struggle or departure. The only clue left behind was the chilling echo in the empty house, not alone, never alone. To this day, people say Emma still resides in the old house, not alone but with her unseen bedfellow, lost forever in her never-ending nightmare. Sleep tight dear listeners, and remember to check under your bed tonight. If you enjoyed our chilling tale of Unseen Bedfellow, don't forget to hit the likes button. If you want more chilling tales and creepy pastas delivered right to your screen, don't forget to hit subscribe. We're always here, ready to guide you through the darkness, unveiling the uncanny mysteries that lurk in the shadows. We'll be back soon with another eerie story to keep you up at night. Until then, remember, you're never truly alone. Good night, stay safe, and remember, there's always something watching from the unseen. <laughs>